hey guys coming to you live i forgot to film an intro for this video so i'm here to film an intro um i know i apologize it's been like two weeks since i posted life has just been a little crazy november has been just such a weird month i don't know good things are coming in december but um yeah so sorry about that i apologize for being absent these past two weeks three weeks i don't even know um but i'm back with today's video it is a vlog over the past i guess november um it's halloween oh back to october oh my god kind of i don't know it's been a little crazy in this video you'll see me getting ready for halloween with my friend that was super fun and then um we go on a little friends date to pho oh i dog i dog tat for my aunt so i got a couple clips at her house but yeah i hope you guys enjoy um all videos from now on will be up to date new content coming out i'm brainstorming right now so be on the lookout for that don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on the post notifications so you get notified every single time i upload a video <laughs> hope you guys enjoy this video hey guys it is 4 p.m now much later i ate i relaxed i chilled for a bit and now it is time to start getting ready so i just washed my face so that I can have a clean slate for my makeup and but I'm not doing my makeup till later till my friend gets here till Lindra gets here and she's not getting here till like five so we have an hour and in that time I'm going to straighten my hair but I just washed my face before so that I wouldn't get my hair wet just posted an Instagram picture on Instagram go follow me at Jenny Hyman underscore so you guys can Stay updated. Let's straighten my hair. Transforming myself into a brat dog. This is the straightener that I use. I love this one. It's the Remington straightener. It's not like the classic tiny ones. It's like grab, grabs more hair, which I like. And right now I have it. Usually the regular time, the regular heat is 370, but I have it at 350. So I don't. Um, fry my hair that much i haven't strained my hair in so long i think the last time i strained my hair was in when was it was in june was it june no july it was like the beginnings of july for my friend's birthday that was the last time i strained my hair and since then my hair has gotten so much i mean i thought my hair was long back then but since then it's gotten so much longer so i'm always i always get excited to see how my hair looks straightened because as I said, I have wavier curly hair. Wavier curly hair. Ugh, I cannot talk. As I said, I have wavier curlier hair. So you can't really see the true length of my hair unless I straighten it. And yeah, I'm excited because it's gonna look extra long. I mean, look at that, you could already tell. It's like under my boob. When usually when it's like curly, it's like at my boob almost. Up until these past couple of years, I haven't had long hair until now, um, and I love it. I don't think I'm going back to short in a very long time. Um, sometimes I do get like little moments where I want to go back short, but I'm enjoying long hair right now. I feel like I just look more mature, and I don't know. Yeah, I'm just going to continue doing the rest of my hair. I'm sure you guys know how to straighten your hair. And we'll be back. I finished straining my hair. What do you guys think? I put a bit of oil. I put some of this Garnier Fructis Anti Frizz Serum. Um, just a tiny bit for like my frizz, especially up here. But this is how it looks. Look how long it looks. <laughs> I love it. Hopefully, I didn't miss some pieces. That's my hair. I'm here with Jacket. We're yeah. gonna get ready together. I'm Jade. She's Cher, Cher. the tennis player scene. This is my inspo. 
So blue eyeshadow, big, oh, big lips, eyeliner. I'm a little nervous. Also, I'm using, I'm going to be using tape for this because I'm not a makeup artist pro. That looks about right. Oh my god, I can't blink. I'm not the best at eyeshadow, so <laughs> Dre can help me if I need, oh. need help. I'm not good either. I just now realized this like a couple weeks ago. What? That the shape of the telescope of mascara is like a telescope. Like Wait, I knew, why am I just realizing I that now? I knew the name, right? And everything. And like then I was like, oh my gosh, it's a telescope. We're literally so dumb. I know, I can't. <laughs> Okay, that's my. Now I'm gonna clean it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 that's gonna be good. That's gonna be good. And take it off. I'm excited to see. Yeah. Okay, okay thanks. You're boosting my ego. He did. What's your favorite Halloween movie? Oh. Yes. I feel like I don't even. Like, I don't know. I think I was telling my aunt that I haven't even seen Hocus Pocus. Me either. Yeah. And I feel like that's low-key, like, a like, uh, popular one. Yeah. Well, I feel like I've seen clips growing up. Um, The Nightmare Before... Mm. What is it called? Yeah, The Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, that one. That's a Halloween movie, right? Oh, yeah, people do, you know, if it's, like, is it Halloween, is it Christmas? Yeah. Yeah, I think it is. But I think what came to mind was Halloween Town. Have you ever seen Halloween Town? It sounds very funny. It's fun Disney, though. and it's, like, old. I don't think I have that. Dude, that one... It's, like, almost, like, 90s. What's your favorite? I don't know if, like, I don't know, because I don't know if, like, yeah, I feel like I haven't seen, like, so many iconic ones. I, I want to say Coraline. I haven't even seen that one. Dude, I know, I literally saw it, like, sophomore year. That was, like, the first time I was watching it, and I watched it in French, so oh I like watch it It's the doll, right? Yeah. Guys! <laughs> it's Jade and oh, Cher! It's Jade and Cher. <laughs> but now I have to draw on my lips and... Oh, one second. I don't even know how to do this though. So. This is my oh final, God. I'll show you guys, inspo. Hollister Thrifted yes. H&M, I think. Here's my makeup. Okay, where's your top from? It's yours. White top is mine from Boohoo, I think. Yeah, and then this one, it's like a white pink top from Walmart. I mean, white, black. And these biker shorts. Air Force's tennis racket. Yes. Period. Good morning, guys. Sorry if I sound a little stuffy. I've been having some allergies, and um, it's just my nose like clogged up. I think it's like the weather changing. I don't know. Also, sorry if the lighting keeps changing. I'm filming on my phone but today is november 7th i think saturday and they just announced well like a couple hours ago i think they just announced that joe biden is our president and kamala is our vice president regardless of your political views this is huge like this is history in the making because kamala is our first female vice president sorry if i'm not looking at the viewfinder she is our first female vice president and she's a woman of color so that is something huge to celebrate and um i don't know just that's incredible but um don't want to get don't want to talk too much about politics because people get really mad i'm on my way to pick up my friend i brought with me my juice that i made in here i just put carrots celery uh lemon ginger uh lettuce i didn't have any like spinach so i put lettuce in there and apple i think that's it and then i also brought with me some tea i am an avid tea drinker i don't drink coffee um so i love tea and this one is turmeric cinnamon moringa moringa i don't know i'll show you guys my outfit when we get there i'm not wearing this my friend's actually gonna let me borrow one of her hoodies that I wanted to borrow, so we're gonna get going. I'm gonna start driving. We're friends! <laughs> Hello. This is my fit. Hoodie is champion. Thrifted Air Force. We're after 
this door. <laughs> I think you knew how to use it. Sorry guys, I forgot to vlog, but my pho, it was delicious. 10 out of 10. It's called Pho Kim Long. It was delicious. What do you rate it? A 9. A nine. Low key 9. An 8.5. I rate it a 9. What do you think? Negative 10. Oh my god. <laughs> That's got me She got some beef. She's beefy. I think we need a post. I'm gonna lay, but I'm dead. Jenny said, take off your phone. I'm gonna lay, but I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, we're cuddling. Good morning, guys. Hopefully, I'm in frame. I can't see myself. Today is Wednesday, November 11th. It is 8.45 a.m. and I just showered. I'm in a new location if you couldn't tell. I'm currently house sitting and dog sitting for one of my aunts. So, I've been here since Monday, it is now Wednesday. Today is actually my last day. Also, don't we love this lighting? Like, their house. I love their house. I want my house to look like this house. <laughs> my future house. But it's so cute. It reminds me of like a trendy coffee shop. And I love it. The vibes were immaculate this morning. I got up really early actually. Um, I don't know why. Oh, happy Veterans Day. It's Veterans Day. Thank you to all the veterans. My hair has grown quite a bit. And I really want to cut it. Not sure. I just want to. I need a trim. And then I want to get curtain things really bad. They wouldn't be like, oh my god, never, I would never do that. It would just be like a little longer so I can like pull them out and like it would look cute. I also want to dye it but um, I don't think I could do that right now. I don't know, it's a lot. But I want to, or I shouldn't say dye it, I want to lighten it. My hair is like dark brown I would say. And I want it lighter, I want it like more, I want it more brunette. The lighting in here is amazing. We love, let me introduce you guys to the doggies. They're waiting for their food. This is Olaf. Hi Olaf. This is, oh, hello. He is super cuddly. And this is Chavo. Hi Chavo. Oh, okay. Don't mind if you hear the doggies munching in the back, but I'm gonna have some tea. Currently drinking the lemon ginger plus probiotics. This is super good for your gut um, and for your digestion. It makes me poop. Yay! So I'm gonna have a cup of tea. I'm gonna make breakfast. I'm making um, like a yogurt parfait. Parfait, is that how you say? It? I don't know. A little yogurt bowl and a rice cake. I've been loving rice cakes recently. I'm trying not to eat like a lot of bready stuff. Obviously, not the best for you. So I've been trying to avoid that and it's really hard. I didn't realize how much bread I eat. Like, I love bread. I love bagels, I love bread, I love pasta. Carbs, I love carbs, basically. I've been on this journey to find the best dairy-free yogurt. If you guys have any recommendations, let me know down below. But um, right now, I'm trying the Kite Hill. Well, I already had it yesterday, and it's pretty good. I think I should have gotten a different one. I got the plain and sweetened, and it's very bitter. I For a second, I thought it, w it had gone bad because it just didn't taste right. But um, it's because I got the plain and unsweetened. But once you add everything, it's pretty bomb. If you guys have any suggestions for any dairy-free yogurt, let me know. So I have this bowl here with me. I'm going to add some to the bowl. Now for the toppings. My favorite part, I brought some pomegranate seeds from home with me. So I'm going to add some pomegranate seeds. Delicious. 
And then I'm going to top it off with some strawberries that I just cut up. Then I'm going to take some hemp seeds. I'm, this is my first time trying hemp seeds, but I'm going to add some in there. Next, I'm going to add some granola. And to finish it off, I'm going to add some peanut butter. Let's mix this up. Okay, now for some rice cakes. These are the rice cakes I use, the lightly salted Quaker ones. Um, I'm making myself one for now. If I get, if I'm still hungry, I'll make myself another one. But I'm using the Justin's peanut butter. I love peanut butter. Look at that. Now I'm gonna use the Crofters. Crofters Berry Harvest. This is one of the best like preserves, jams, whatever. You can get it at Trader Joe's or Whole Foods. Yeah, Whole Foods. There's some of that on there. I'm going to top it off with some bananas.